these are uncut covers from our Riffs at CCG that came out in, uh, I forget when, in, in the 1990s. Uh, um, 2001. There you go, 2001. I was thinking like 99, 98, but 2001. And, uh, you know, these are sheets before they're cut. And we like them, they're cool. You know, use them kind of as a posters. Also, we can use all the artwork, so it's a quick, easy reference to say, hey, you know, can we turn this into a cover or, you know, whatever. So that's what those are. Um, you know, the place is a little tore up for the, uh, for the event. <clears throat> But uh, that's Jeff Hansen's desk. It's kind of pushed back, and there's another desk that usually goes here. No, um, we expect Jeff to sit behind that desk where it's at. He's got to climb around there. And he would. <laughs> um, that's a Boris Vallejo that I picked up at an auction. Um, that's a Brian Froud print. I love Brian Froud. And uh, it actually has some original drawings by him. Um, Painting is crooked, but that's a Keith Parkinson. Those are a bunch of reference books, mine and, and Jeff's. Um, you got the original Robotech cover. And the story behind this, by the way, there is a story behind this. The cover was originally supposed to be a wraparound cover, just as you see it there. But Kevin Long couldn't get it done in time. And he had everything done except the SDF-3. Uh, S1. Or it's SDF-1, yeah. excuse me. And... Uh, so we just cropped it and just used the front, and we always meant to use the back cover either as a cover to a source book or uh, in a future edition, but we never did. Uh, and of course, that's a uh, ghost ship. And uh, over there, um, that's the original Defilers, my, my gaming group from 1979 to about 1982. Um, they commissioned me to do that piece, and uh, I painted it up after I was done with it. Like the gaming center days. Gaming center days, yep. And uh, the fairies are just a couple of pieces of my artwork. And then uh, this is uh, another office for the editors. Again, you know, things are a little um, in disarray because of the event. That dust doesn't sit there normally. Um, yeah. He has an old cover to uh, Palladium Fantasy. That's the original cover to Beyond the Supernatural. Some of my art, uh, the Ninja Turtle cover. Um, in here, you can see an editor actually at work. In its Deep natural quiet, habitat. Not to disturb him and do not feed him. <laughs> Don't poke him, either, Steve. That's Alex Marcinison, um with a bunch of art that he likes. There's also some Robotech pieces in there and some of his reference books and things. Uh, my office is a little messy, but this is uh, my office. Um, that's my alien that I love. And uh, artwork I find inspirational. Keith Parkinson here behind me. And Keith Parkinson, Kevin Long, Kevin Long, Keith Parkinson, a couple of Alex Ross. Um, some photographs, a uh, special plaque that I love. i got to go to the store and fix that today. That's the whole Lord of Salt thing, ain't it? Yes. Yeah. Yep, that was the very first piece I ever bought. Yeah, I don't know that. Yep, yeah, from D&D. &D. Yeah, from, from Dragonlands. Well, Dragonlands, yep. Bag, yeah. Yep. So, yeah, I've had a few D&D &D fans come in here and like, <gasps> you know, like, yeah, that's right. I, I, like, the, I, like, I like the art more than I like the, the, what happened to it, so. Yeah. <laughs> Once upon a time, you, you know, I said my D &D. desk is, you know, kind of messy right now, but no, I just ran. <laughs> that's my desk. <laughs> um, the music CD is over there. That's what I listen to when I'm uh, writing. Um, uh, I, I can't listen to music with words because it distracts me. So I've got a ton of uh, movie scores and a little yeah. bit of classical music, but mostly movie scores. Right now, but this is uh, more, more of a library in there. This is our, our front entrance. I like this guy. Representative of American <laughs> government. <coughs> yeah, dog and pony show. Yeah. Yeah, pretty much. There's our guard goose. Uh, what's that? <laughs> Goose that was on the roof. 
I wouldn't be surprised. I actually think we have a, a goose nest up there if they ever nest high. I don't know enough about geese, but uh, yeah, they're up on that roof all the time and up there so often. I'm, I'm just plus there have been times. In fact, the first time it happened, I'm thinking, oh my gosh, someone's breaking into the building. Cause you hear the boom, 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 and you know, I, I, I grabbed a hammer and I run in here, and it's like there's nobody here. A hammer? Yeah. Well, your crowbar and you're off. so different from us. <laughs> I put we put a couple of rounds of forty five through the roof. Oh no! Oh well. I don't have a gun, so the hammer is the best I can. I can see you one. I, I and, sell them. Uh, <laughs> That's what I do for a living. And uh, my brother has several. He's really into guns. But uh, I'm like, what the heck's that noise? And then I came to realize later, it's the geese up on the roof. There's two of them that are usually up there. Oh, here you get to see another one of Clayton's numbers actually at work. Pretending this is Wayne Smith. Really? This is our production the nice, Yeah, yeah, the, you get to be a D. That's cool. Yeah, the I Wayne like that. Smith. You need me to leave some money on the counter, I will. This is where you we do our, quite a few times. You know, cut yeah. and paste mm -hmm. and um, Wayne was scanning a piece of art that uh, someone purchased that we might be might be using in a future book. Awesome. Ooh. It's uh, a rare Chuck collaboration. Martin pencils with uh, Alan Manning inks, and it's gorgeous. Yeah, it is. Yeah, great job. Hi, Perry. These are uh, some of the original uh, covers to various books by Jen Zalesnik. Yeah. Excuse me, I gotta, I gotta move on so you can see me on the next one. <laughs> <laughs> Good man. I'm into Star Wars, various Star Wars things. And this is Wayne Smith's office. Oh. And there's another one. Wayne Smith here. <laughs> this is the other Wayne Smith. You got, <laughs> you got two of them. I always wondered how you did there that. There you go. I, if you know, had two or three of me, we'd be all sorry. You put some. Man, up. yeah. <laughs> it, don't worry. If you need money for that, so have you I'm with expunged you. the demons from your computers? Uh, we should hope so. <laughs> just jinxed us, kill him. What's wrong with, what's wrong with your computer? Uh, we just ran into some uh, glitches. Oh, man. They're um, having computer problems. You know, those are uh, a couple original covers from. Uh, Oops. Mm, Wayne's uh, Guardian Spider Man familiar. Same place as the old warehouse. Do you feed him Mary Jane's or? Let go. Let me find him cheap. <laughs> yeah. don't, don't forget to point out Crash. I did. I said, oh, it's Wayne's you, right? Turtle. Yeah. Crash. He's, uh, Wayne had the rocks pile up a bit higher and he used to come out and well, the first fall night, to the ground. The first night I had him in a... Terrarium. In another, yeah, in another tank. I had the, I, well, I had the water too high. Yeah. And uh, you found him on the floor <laughs> the next morning. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> And then, like the next morning, no, 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 just was, once. was it this one? Just once. I, it was I took the water out. He couldn't sleep. Oh, yeah, yeah. I think it's cool. You keep so all the turtles and tanks around right here. They're like this big down there in Mobile. And so oh, so how long sure. have you yeah. had them? Uh, I've had him seven eight years. Yeah. And that's basically the office. You guys have seen that's the warehouse, right? Yeah. yeah. So I hope that was a $20 each for the tour. <laughs> wow, no, price has gone up today. Yeah, Just right. kidding. <laughs> okay, when you get it in the mail, ain't gonna be no return address. So you got <laughs> uh, this guy's worried about getting his art, so I should probably return it. All we're doing is this is the kitchen. It's just a kitchen. It's not you know, I mean, it's yep. So it's, it's nice to have a kitchen where you can actually sit down at the old warehouse. Uh, it's about corner. half Standing the room. size. It was, yeah, basically. You're standing in the corner with flats on the floor. Yep, yeah, that's it. So, but, uh,. That's the place, guys. And if you want to have a uh, panel talk, we can just walk this right over and hey, start that, talking. Hey, that's what I'm talking about. Panel talk. Oh, dude. You want to gather up people on the way?